Hello Instagram. Recently I've been telling you about a bunch of series that I've been enjoying watching and I've got a brand new one for you. So if you are a DSTV subscriber and you have Mnet, tune in on Sunday in the movie slot at 8 for a brand new series called Recipes for Love and Murder. It is a, um, a series adapted from the book from Sally Andrew um, and I don't know if I would wax lyrical as much as I'm about to if I didn't really enjoy the series. We saw the preview a couple weeks ago and it is a breath of fresh air. It is the cutest, um, slightly darkish murder mystery, but with a really well written script. It is beautiful comedy writing and um, the acting and the casting is incredible there are some um, guest stars that come in every episode a brand new um, person will be introduced and it is absolutely delightful the way that they use color the way that the wardrobe is used in the show and the food styling is almost pornographic in how beautiful and like delectable they make this food look basically the story revolves around a um, recipe writer in the town she's played by maria doyle kennedy who i'm a huge fan of she's from outlander um, but i fell in love with her as her character on orphan black she's an irish uh, woman and she's in town and she writes recipes for the local gazette and they decide that these recipes are not sort of doing anything for the paper, so they would like to do an agony aunt kind of column. So what the character Tani Marie does is she starts to give advice to people who've written letters into the Gazette and gives them advice through food. Um, so for instance, a cake that will help you seduce your lover or um, a lamb curry that will like knock the socks off your husband. And in the process, there's a murder in town and Tani Marie somehow gets roped into like investigating this and she butts head with the local police. There is a um, up and coming reporter who's kind of her um, instigator in helping her sort of like, get to the bottom of this murder. And it is just absolutely fun. It is beautiful there is this murder mystery theme throughout of it who done it kind of uh, thing and recently i've told you kind of love this kind of genre um and it's an african mystery um an african mystery original from mnet so they've poured a lot of money into it and it is beautiful the way that it is shot the way they use this claim dorpy in the Karoo. And um, it centers around this gazette, which runs out of the local Slaches. So it's quirky in that regard. The Slaches is painted bright pink. It's absolutely stunning the way it's done. I can't recommend it enough. And if you do have Mnet, if you have catch up, if you have um, the actual service on Sunday, tune in on the movie um, slot. It will really, it'll delight you and your family. It's honestly a beautiful show to watch. So make sure you tune in. And there's something about pomegranate in the show. I think that's important. So keep your eye on the series because Mnet did a drop and they gave us a whole bunch of products that feature pomegranate so um thanks very much for the press drop emnet but seriously guys it's 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 a delightful series you won't you won't you won't hate it i promise